Today is November 30th, 2020, and it's a pretty exciting day because Tesla just dropped off the first set of material for phase one of our Tesla solar glass roof. This looks like flashing as well as vent covers and all the roof underlayment that uh, our subcontractor is uh, gonna get ready to install tomorrow. So we're, uh, we're pretty excited here to, to finally uh, get going on this project. Hi, and welcome to Engineering Life. My name is John, and I'm here to share my experience working with Tesla Solar. After more than a year of preparations, we are finally underway on our Tesla solar glass roof install here at our home in Denver, Colorado. The roof we're having installed will have a solar generating capacity of about 8.5 kilowatts. Based on our energy usage for the last two years, we could have gone with the system closer to 10 kilowatts, but Tesla maxed out our roof layout with the 8.5 kilowatt system. The solar glass roof is made of two types of glass tiles. Tiles with integrated photovoltaics that generate electricity and dummy tiles that don't. Both tiles look the same. This combination of tiles allows Tesla to match the size of the system to the individual household electricity usage. Here you see the roof before tear off. Our home was hit with a hailstorm in June of 2018 and it was a storm that produced baseball sized hail. You can see a number of cracked tiles due to that storm. After going back and forth with the insurance company, the claim was finally settled in early 2020. I submitted the Tesla solar glass order and paid my $100 deposit in November of 2019 in anticipation of the settlement. Tesla submitted their initial design to me in March of 2020 and after correcting some errors in their design assumptions, which were based solely on satellite imagery, I signed the purchase agreement in April. All permitting was complete in September, thanks to backups within the county permitting offices due to the pandemic, and in October, I received a project start date of Monday, November 30th. Tesla sent out a site survey team on November 12th and made some final tweaks to the project layout based upon the information that they found. After some more discussion on additional costs, as well as back and forth on the design, I signed an updated contract the morning that the installation was slated to begin. The first phase of the project is to remove the existing concrete tiles and dry in the roof underlayment as well as install new flashing. They do this section by section and don't leave any part of the roof without waterproofing overnight. The subcontractor Tesla hired for phase one started work on Tuesday, December 1st and worked from sunup to sundown for two days to get their portion complete. The Tesla project manager called in for the inspection the next morning and was on site beforehand to do his own look through. With a past mid-roof inspection that morning, we were now on track for solar glass installation on Monday, December 7th. I filmed this video to share my experience working with Tesla on this futuristic construction project and to document the process for anybody interested. I plan on doing additional videos for the next installation phase, a final roof review, and a full cost breakdown. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're interested in learning more. If you've got any questions, I'd be happy to answer them. Leave them in the comments below. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next one.